How are you? Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah, she's so long. She doing all right? Uh huh. Just coughing up a storm. I'm just sure. I know. I know. I know. But she was here yesterday just blowing her nose here and there and just, you know, I told her, I said, you know, go home because I can handle the store by myself, you know. You give her my love for me. Okay? Yeah. I know, I know. Oh, hold on, there's a customer. I'm gonna have to call you back. Hold on a minute, huh? I'll be right with you, okay? Yeah? Oh, sh no, 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 don't bother her. I'm sure she's napping along. Just don't worry about it, okay? I'm fine. I can handle everything in here, okay? You tell her not to worry. You tell her to calm herself, stay calm. Don't over agitate herself, you know. Calm down, sleep a lot. Lots of, you know, fluids and liquids and all that, you know. Make us some tea, hon. Yeah, I'm sure she'll like that. Okay. Okay, you let me know how it goes. Or call you. Yeah. Or call you. Okay, bye, love. Okay, bye, 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 bye. Kisses, kisses. Okay, bye. Sorry about that. My friend Kwani, she's a bit sick today. So, it's just me and the show up for now. What's that? Oh, you know Kwan? You were hoping to find her here. Um, she got the most horrible flu in the history of flus, hon. She was in here coughing all day yesterday. I told her to go home. What are you doing here? You know, it's just not okay. I know. I know, hon. I know you love her. I love her too. So. Yeah, you call it a day if you want. I actually just got off the phone with her mother. She says... She's doing a bit better, but you know, still the slim. Yeah, it's not good. Okay. So, what can I do for you today, honey? Hold on a second. Hold on just a moment. Do I know you from somewhere? You know, I hardly ever forget a face. I feel like I've known you from somewhere. Hold on a second. Didn't you come in here like months ago asking for a prom dress? Oh my god. It's you. <laughs> you were so gorgeous. I'm Maria. Nice to meet you. Kwan has told me so much about you. Oh, I feel like I know you already. Yeah. Oh my god, I told, I said, you know, oh my god, uh, how many times she's told me about you. I just told myself, I told her, Kwan, you gotta go, you gotta get yourself that. That, that's the type of person that is just, you know, you're going to be your friend forever, for life, you know, you're going to be close, you're going to be sick as Steve's and, you know, right, you know, and you are, she talks about you all the time, I know, but unfortunately, you know how this bug sees in the flow and all the answers going along, we all, yeah, yesterday she was all flummy, mm -mm -mm, it's not quite, I told her to go on, so anyways, Oh, I'm finally meeting you. How good is that? So, so happy to meet you. Yeah, honey. Oh. 
I feel like I know you already. You know, you were gonna be real good friends, me and you. Yeah. Corn, you know, we're like sisters practically. Well, we're kind of, we're, we're second cousins once removed from our father's side. So, well, my father. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. Of course, yeah, yeah. Well, practically everyone in this town is related, so you know, it's not that big a deal, but still. Okay, so, enough with the blabbering. You obviously came here because you need something done, right? Okay, so you tell me, you tell Maria what you need done. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. A bag. A bag that you need. So. Mm hmm. Oh, I can do that for you. No issues whatsoever, and I won't even charge you because you're Connie's friend, and automatically you are my friend. So, so you don't shut up. Shut up, shut up. You don't. Mm -mm, I don't want to hear that. Just close your mouth. I don't want to hear that. I'm not going to hear it. You just sit down. You keep me as company. I will sew that up for you right now. No questions asked. Alright? Okay. Sure, if you don't mind, I'm going to be doing a couple of different works today. But I can definitely go ahead and sew your bag up for you. Let's see what I got here. I got my big bag of tricks here. Oh, little floofers in there. So, I got a whole bunch of different colors. Mm -hmm. You've got your dark blue, your light blue, your navy, your khaki green, your peach, your brown, your khaki brown, your khaki green, your lime green, your light lime green, your yellow, your soft pastel yellow, your whites, you gotta have white all the time, hun. your pink, your hot pink, your green green, your gray, your brown, your gray gray, your dark gray blue, your purples, and your red. And this is the kit I bring around with me all the time, because you never know when someone's gonna need some fixing up, you know. So this is the bag that I always have with me, just in case. And you know, it comes in handy. And then we squirt some of this stuff here, so. I've got my little pen, pencil, my pliers, in case we need anything that needs to be loosened, okay? We've got a little metal uh, unstitcher, a measuring tape. We've got little scissors and clips and just some, a couple of different things around, just bits and bobs, you know. Because I, of course we have extra stuff in here because of course this is a shop. But I always bring one because I just, I love to have my own things, you know. Yeah, I, I need to have like my own things because I just I feel like more personally connected to my own things you know what I mean yeah, yeah. so yeah, yeah that's what we're going to alright so what is the bag that you need fixing set it right there okay give it to me huh mm -hmm. okay this looks like a really nice bag Where'd you get this gorgeous stunner of a bag? I don't know. Oh, wow. How oh, can I just take a look at it? You don't mind? Mm -hmm. Boy, me. Now this just looks like a mortal. Okay. 
Okay, so this is definitely a cotton bag. Mm -hmm. So you've got navy and a khaki sort of off-white. But I think I'm an extra white like that. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see where it's coming off a little bit there. I can definitely work, work with that and I can fix it for you. Mm -hmm. really coming loose in here. You still got your silicone packet in here. You never use the bag? Mm, okay, so you received it as a gift. Your cousin broke it. They no more children or evil things. Alright, so let me see here that we want. Mm -hmm. I can definitely work with this. I can definitely fix this for you. Not a problem, hon. Not a problem whatsoever. Alright? Alright, so we need a Kiki blue color, which I've got in my kit. All right, this color will good look real, real good. As you can see, it matches perfectly with the blue in the bag, right? Mm -hmm. Perfectly. Right. Okay, so we're gonna work with this color. So I'm going to open up a new bag for you. New container. I bought myself recently some new little needles. And they're the sorted needles. Extra fine. 100 quality grade needles. I just love needles, don't you? Especially a new bag. Still sealed. Oh goodness gracious me. Love myself some needles. Mm -hmm. Kit number nine out so that's the kit we're gonna use today. Okay, here we go. Turn and turn and turn and Gonna choose a needle. Hmm, which needle shall we choose today? Hmm. Probably this one. Yeah, that looks like a good one. So, hon, what are you going to tell me about your life, how things going? Do you study or do you work? Uh-huh. Do you want some?
something you want a coffee or a tea or something, I can make it for you. No? Okay, well you just let me know if you want anything. You know, the store is so quiet without corn arounds. I miss her. Yeah, I miss her so much. Just isn't fair, you know. I know, it's just a big ugly bug coming around. Good thing we both didn't get up. That's what I would have to just close the store. I'm fixing a bit around this zipper here because I noticed it's a little bit loose around the edge here. Yeah. Okay. I don't mind. Yeah. Oh, definitely. I agree with you. Mm -hmm. Oh, do you mind if I get that? I'll just be a moment. Hello, Quants and Marys. How can I help you? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh huh. I can definitely do that for you, hon. Hold on a second. Can I just take your name and your number? Mm-hmm. Okay, new number. That's perfect. That's wonderful. Could you repeat that for me just so I know? I can make sure. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Perfect. Beautiful. And so that's three bridesmaids. Will the lovely mother of the bride be joining us? Mm -hmm.
Yeah, absolutely, hon. We have a variety of dresses that are just right, even for the mother-in-law. We can make it look so fashionable and so up there and so nice. Sure, you come down here and I'll show you. You bring her along and I'm sure I can convince you and her. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so that will be on the 28th of November. Beautiful. That's been confirmed. I will see you then. Okay. Beautiful. Okay. You know where we are. Alrighty. Bye now. Bye, hon. Bye. Bye, bye, bye. Brides are big and bridesmaids. Oh my god, we're gonna be so busy. Yeah, this year we've got at least 10 brides coming in for fittings. Because you know, everyone wants like a Christmas wedding, winter wonderland sort of wedding, you know. And so, everyone's doing that now. Yeah, this is Madonna. Will follow trends, you know what I mean. All right, I think that's pretty much done. Not gonna go anywhere, okay? Okay. Let me just go ahead and snip, snip. There we go. All done. Oh, I even fixed that little patch right here that was sort of coming off, okay? Okay. So I hope you like it. Nothing else is coming off or coming loose. I don't see any holes in here. Fix that little water right there. Otherwise, it's a pretty sturdy bag. Beautiful texture. I love this pattern. Where did you get this bag? Oh, friend, someone gave it to you. Where did they get it? Oh, I want those pants just like this. Mm -hmm. Well, if you can ask them for me and like call me, like seriously, I want to know. Mm -hmm. Here, I'll just put it right here for you. No, 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 sit down. Come, you can keep me company, see ya. Because ever since corn left, you know, I just feel a bit lonely just sitting in here in this shop all alone, just blabbing around to myself, so. Sure. Yeah, I was just putting some stuff away. Mm-hmm. Well, I went ahead and I bought some no pins for the shop. Because as you can see, these look a little bit dingy, while these ones are brand new. So I'm going to be not throwing them out because you never know if you need a new pen somewhere. But I'm definitely not going to be using them because customers, they take a look at, this, at these things and you know. You don't want any glaring eyes. It's not a good look for you. Some of these shops, they just, they never update, they never get with the program, they never make sure that everything's up to date, you know? And so they lose customers, and I'm seeing it every day. People are coming in here more and more, they're just coming, they're just always in. Yeah, sometimes, since
since I'm alone in the shop, I could play with my jacket or my sleeves or something. Because leather makes a real funny sound, but this is fake leather. Um, this is why it's coming off. But I like that Michael Jackson Madonna feel when things are just scratched and like dingy, you know. So sometimes I scratch my own fake leather jacket. Um, hello, they sell fake leather jackets all scratched up. That cost a triple of just a fake leather jacket that you can buy and scratch up yourself. Like, hello, hello, you don't need to go buy something that's damaged. Just buy something that's not damaged and damaging yourself like some people are just so lazy. Right, I know. You understand me. <laughs> Alrighty, a minute. Let me just have to cut some fabrics here. Do mind just keeping me company for a bit. Yeah. Without corn here, it's just not the same. Mm -mm. You're absolutely not. You're absolutely right. It's because Kwani, she's the life of the party, you know. She just brings the good out of everyone. Everyone loves her. She makes me such a better person. You don't know. Oh, I love that kid. I love her so much. I love her to death. You know, you went to high school together. Mm-hmm. And now she's studying, so she's so smart. I heard you helped her with her exams and all. Oh. You don't know how much she talks about you. She says you're amazing and that you're just like the most incredible person she's ever met. You don't know how much good things she says about you. Mm -hmm. It's true. She just loves you, huh? Absolutely just finds you so adorable. Just adorable. You know what? You have to come over sometime and we'll have some coffee all together, all three of us, and just talk cosmos. Watch some TV together. Just talk and laugh and eat. <sighs> I need more girlfriends in my life. Yeah, it's true. I've got so many nice girlfriends, but I need like the perfect girlfriends. You know what I mean? Yeah, and. Since Quan, she says so many nice things about you. I feel like you and I, you can, you and I can get a blonde. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. I think you and I are gonna be such good friends. Absolutely. I'm just sorry you. What man, on such a north day. It's cause Corny's not here and like I'm so sad and also I think I'm coming down with something so I hope I don't get sick like her. Oh no. And also I'm just a little bit sad because I've been here for at least 
12 day hours yesterday and today and I'm just so pumped up with the aura I don't know what I do you know what until she gets better why don't you just stay with me like not stay here of course I'm gonna go home someone anyways but you know what I mean like you can come over here sometimes and just to keep me company until she gets better and then we can surprise her when she gets here and then you know what do you say? because I just want to get to know you like she's talked such good things about you and I just, I just want to be like close to you and blonde and like Oh, hon, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you so much. Now I know why she says that you're such a tool, such an angel, because you seriously, you seriously are. You seriously are. I don't even know. I don't even know. I love you so much. Thank you, thank you so much.